first of all ask yourself what i need to know about basic grammar for forming sentences and i promise i will be guiding you to start from the very base and to a continuous process of learning and understanding english grammar the very first step you need to know is part of speech now what is part of speech here are only words given in the box and you need to know how to place those words in a particular way that it can make a proper sentence for example i have chosen very basic very simple words to make a sentence like the big boy ran quickly towards his house when he heard a scream if i use these words as individual it doesn't make any sense but if i put them together at the correct place that will make a proper sentence this is how part of speech works now the step 2 subject or verb agreement now what is subject and verb agreement subject is subject can be of two types singular and plural and verb agreements are are tenses we have learned tenses a lot of times in our school time till our college time and till the time we are learning english language or its grammar parts it does play very important role in our life and i promise i will be making a new video a short video making you understand tenses in a very easy way in hindi tense are called kal in a very simple way if i tell you tenses are time टेंस हमारा टाइम होता है जिस टाइम पीरियड में आप एक पर्टिकुलर टाइम में जो आप काम कर रहे हो या आप कोई काम कर चुके हो उसका पूरा होना टेंस कहलाता है देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ टेंसेस पास्ट प्रेजेंट एंड फ्यूचर एंड इट हैज देर फोर काइंड इट्स सिंपल और अफॉर्मेटिव कॉन्टिन्यूस परफेक्ट एंड परफेक्ट कॉन्टिन्यूस नाउ फोर्थ स्टेप लिंकिंग वर्ड्स This also plays a very important role in understanding grammar to establish clear connection between ideas thoughts and situations in a speech conjunctions subordinate conjunctions dependent clause dependent clause has a s and v but doesn't express complete thought it has independent clauses subject it has subject and verb and express complete thought there is mentioned s and v is subject and verb these are like simple compound complex and complex compound complex now it might be confusing you what are these these are grammar subjects topics which we will be covering in my next videos and conjunctions are for and not but or yet so after even if although as if so that until because unless while then in case whoever if once ye wo words hain jo ki ek baat ko dusri baat se jodte hain jo do baaton ko ek sentence mein jodne ka kaam karte hain For example, examples of dependent clause until the sun sets, while flowers continue to bloom. Whenever you come to visit, since I don't have enough money, although I had never considered it, those writing in always intriguing. When the leaves turn into turns colors and fall, that you are listening. whether he can drive that far these were some examples for dependent clause what is dependent clause dependent clause are if second subject second sentence depends on the first one if we don't use first sentence 
the second sentence won't be able to clear this was the only video one just to tell you about grammar steps and how does that work make sure you are subscribing the channel